How's it going today guys? My name is JSP and today I wanted to take a moment to talk about the new Halo series or should I freaking call it that? Now I have been a Halo fan my entire life. I am 22 and the first Halo came out in what 2000, 2001? So pretty much my entire life. I think I played the first one when I was like seven or something like that. And then I was addicted ever since. I think my favorite Halo is probably Halo Reach. And ever since that fucking game came out in 2011, it's been going down goddamn hill. Downhill. Halo Infinite wasn't too bad. I actually enjoyed the campaign. I thought it was painfully short, but I still really enjoyed it. Anyway, I'm not here to talk about the games. I'm here to talk about the TV show. I just got done watching episode 2, and I could not be more disappointed. I have a lot to say about this. The first episode wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad. I had no fucking clue what the hell was going on. The only thing I hated was they literally they, they tried to kill him. They tried to kill Master Chief in the first episode. He's seeing his parents. They tried to kill the greatest weapon against the Covenant in the first episode. Like, how? what the fuck is that writing? And then he takes off his helmet. I'm okay with him taking off his helmet. But in the first episode, you go six goddamn games, 20 years without seeing his face, and you take off his helmet in the first episode. What is this writing? I understand... The, the showrunner or the director or who the fuck ever has, n has never played the games or he, he just didn't base it off the games. But why would you hire some fucking idiot that's never even played the games? Don't get me started with the second episode. The second episode, I turned it on and until like 45 minutes into the episode, I literally forgot I was watching Halo. I, did, I, I forgot it was even a Halo series. I really did. I literally, he put his helmet back on, and I was like, oh, fuck, this is Halo. Just put your fucking helmet on. He's not even Master Chief. You go six god, like I said, you go six goddamn games, 20 years without even seeing his face, and the entire second episode is him without his helmet on. What are you doing? What the hell are you doing? I don't give a shit about this human versus human stuff. This politics. I do not care about the politics in the Halo world. Nobody gives a shit. All, even 343 Industries, which I think kind of killed the Halo games, doesn't focus on that. They focus on humans versus aliens. Humans versus Covenant. Because that's literally all it's ever been about. And then don't even get me started about, the, about freaking Cortana. They made her into an AI, which she is in the games, but holy shit, get the design right. Why are you making it, her into a human? She's not human, she's a fucking robot, obviously, but why would you, what's the point of changing her looks? What is the point? Now that I, now I was complaining when the trailer first dropped, I was complaining that... They didn't get the original voice actor, Steve Downs. I've actually met him um, not too long ago, like seven months ago or five months ago or something like that. I think it was um, um, October. I met him last year. He's a really nice dude. Um, I didn't ask him about the TV series, but obviously that was before the video game came out, so I asked him about that. Anyway, Steve Downs, really nice guy. He, I don't know if he wanted to do this, this Halo series, but you get the voice actor of Cortana... Why not get the voice actor of Master Chief? But, I mean, I, I, I completely understand it now. He never has his helmet on. So you can't get his fucking voice actor when he never has his helmet on. I would understand if he always has his helmet on. It's very easy to voice act somebody who always has his helmet on, but he never has it on. So you have to have the voice of the guy who's actually playing Master Chief. Oh my God, man! This this is just not great. I I I'm complaining a lot, but I don't only have negative things about it. 
the the positives of this series so far is the designs master chief looks great when he has the, all of the armor on in the helmet he looks great they got the size right they got the guns right they got the warthogs right they got everything pretty much right pretty much what i believe happened is the person who created this or the director or the showrunner who the fuck ever they created this they looked up freaking google images of what everything is supposed to look like and they put it in the tv show but they refuse to play the games everything looks right the guns the, the outfits everything besides cortana and they just were like we're gonna make everything look like halo but the story is not going to be halo like what why why they tried to kill this is how stupid it is they tried to kill master chief the their biggest humanity's biggest weapon against the covenant they tried to kill him in the first episode the first episode they literally tried to kill him because he was seeing his parents because he was seeing where the truth they tried to suffocate him in the first episode <laughs> it's master chief the the humanity's biggest savior against the fucking covenant who wants to kill humanity i think master chief he would definitely care about where like he was stolen but he wouldn't care so much where he would kill all the humans why are you trying to kill master chief right now it straight up made no sense the girl i mean maybe i i could care less about her i think they're trying to do like a fucking baby yoda where master chief really cares about this fucking girl from some random planet madrigal or whatever like what are you doing i could write it better i've played the games i've played the first one like twice i've played the second one like five times i've played reach i have countless hours on reach i've played four i think once five probably once and an infinite twice now and i could probably write a better script than this bullshit i don't know i don't know what people were thinking and some of the CGI is good. I think the profits look good. I, I don't have only negative things to say about this. I think the designs look great. The guns look good. Like the Warthogs. That, that's like the only good... Th the, the suits look great. Not even just Master Chief. But there's some like armor plates um, that I noticed like that are straight out of the game. Which is really, really cool. So I don't have just negative things to say about this. This... But the, the writing is stupid, the story is stupid, and I've only seen two episodes, and I already fucking hate it. I hate it. It doesn't, I, it, this is not, this is not fucking Halo. The second episode, I, for, I forgot what I was watching. When he was on that, what, what, rock planet, and then that guy was, and he touched the thing, and I was like, and then he put, and then like five minutes later, he put his helmet back on. And I was like, I forgot I'm fucking watching Halo. I've been, I've been wanting a Halo TV show since I was a little kid. And I finally get one. Also, by the way, Paramount Plus, fix your fucking shit. That is one, this is one of the worst. I thought Amazon Prime was bad. This is the worst platform. And I'm not kidding. This is the worst platform. It stutters so bad. If you put subtitles on, oh my god, some try to put subtitles on. It is laughable. It is laughable. You can like pausing pausing and stuff is so laggy. It is it's just awful. I know I have a 10-year-old Xbox One back there, but everything else works fine besides Paramount Plus. So fix your fucking shit. Anyway. That's my rant on Halo. Um, I probably went a little overboard, but I don't care. I just got done watching episode two, and this is exactly how I feel. So I just ranted to the camera, I vented to you guys about a fucking a franchise that I really care about. Give the goddamn, fr give the goddamn franchise to Disney. 
I know ev- Disney's purchasing everything, but they'll fucking do it right. They will they will find somebody and actually spend the money on somebody who gives a shit about Halo. The people working on this project clearly don't give a shit besides the besides the costume designers. People who would who clearly give a shit about the Halo franchise. I, I'm just I'm done with with Sony and Morbius and 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 give it to fucking Disney. I know that's awful to say because they they own everything now, but they're doing the movies right. They're doing it justice. This is not justice for Halo. This is this is this is something else. Honestly, if it was a different if it if it didn't have the Halo name on it and it was it was something else, I'd probably enjoy it. I'd probably enjoy it. It's it's if it didn't have Halo in the title, it would probably be a good TV show. But since you put Halo in the in the title, you have the Halo IP on this TV show. This is not Halo. It's not like awful. It's it's not like a fucking one out of ten. But it's not Halo. That's what makes it so bad. Is that it's not awful TV, but it's not Halo. It's not. I'm sorry. If you enjoy it, go ahead. By all means, enjoy it. But as a true Halo fan, nope. Nope. Uh, I'm going to watch the rest of it. I'm going to watch the rest of it, see how it is. Uh, I don't know. I just... Um, I, I think I, w- I was mad. I was even mad in the second episode because, like I said, I forgot that it w- I was watching a Halo TV series. And then near the end, when he started putting his helmet back on and then taking it off and then putting it back on and then taking it off and then putting it back on, I started getting really pissed. And then right after I started, wa- uh, right after I got done watching this, I sat right here and I'm fucking talking to you guys right now. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I am going to try to cool cool down. Moon Knight, Moon Knight's good. Moon Knight's at least so far. It's got up one episode, but at least so far it's good. Right now, so far, Halo has uh, disappointed me. Hopefully, they can maybe bring it back. So- I don't think so, though. I don't think so. Nah, because now that I see Master Chief, I, I'm going to see his face and. I don't, I don't want that. So I'm going to just, honestly, the rest of the time that I watch, like the rest of the episodes, I'm pretty sure, what, there's eight, ten, whatever. There's already a season two. The rest of the time, I'm just going to try in the back of my head, just watch this TV show without, like, the Halo. But I can't because the Master Chief actually looks pretty good in this series. Like, his suit looks pretty damn good. Anyway, okay, I'm going to stop talking. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, Let me know what you think about the Halo series in the comment section below, and I will see you guys in the next one. Hit that big red subscribe button for me. I would really appreciate it. Have a good day.